What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Susie. All right, so the last part was pretty hectic, but first of all, let me just go into my gear real quick and see see exactly what it is I've picked up. A unique pole arm crafted with insomnian technology. It absorbs the elemental powers of defeated foes. Here's my HP right down, but I'm kind of tempted to try it. Hmm. Yeah, let's try it just to see. So I don't know how I feel about this crossbow. I think I'm gonna go back to my engine blade. Um, you guys saw the crossbow in the last part. It was uh, mental, actually. It was completely mental. So let's see what Kor has to say. That's not the only power your forebears left you. Your journey's just begun. Another tomb lies close by. I suggest you head there next. There are tombs scattered across the land. All are on dangerous ground. I'll go with you, for the time being. Not only to help, but to get a measure of your strength. Oh, nice! So, just how many of these powers are out there? There are 13 known royal arms, each enshrined at a royal tomb, though we know the location of only a few. I've enlisted the help of the hunters. They comb the land in search of the lost tombs. <laughs> Where's the one nearby you mentioned? Kikatrick Trench. We know there to be a crypt deep inside the tunnels. Okay, I just wanted to go around there just to see if there was any items. So wait, he's joining my party. That's so awesome. Hello, guys. Is he here? Am I on my own right now? No, there we go. <laughs> wait, where's Kor? Okay, these guys got nothing on me. Kill it! It's amazing how far you can actually get with that warp strike. Prompto, you all right? Uh, yes, sir. I'm fine, sir. Oh my gosh, I just realized. So I saw a lot of pictures, um, wallpaper pictures before I got this game and there was five members. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's not good. Oh. Man, it's hot. Yeah, but there's... Don't lose the jacket. Did you guys see that? There's like an army of those guys coming right now. Uh oh Long years ago, we waged a fierce battle here against the Empire. It all went to ruin. And after that, the Empire moved in like it owned the place. Best thing I need oh, now. Yeah. Eyes peeled, mouth closed. No, mouth open, mouth wide open. Like Holy shizzle whizzle, what is that? Numbers alone don't decide a battle. What you lack in numbers, you make up for in tactics. Level 32, no! No, 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 no! Leave him alone, leave him alone. How many times? God, he's gonna murder me. <laughs> oh, Jesus. That was terrifying. That thing's a fat mother beep. Okay. Sorry, I freaked out a little bit there. Um, what the heck? Look at all these enemies. Oh, hey, I'll take that. This will make a fine paint. I know, but I just want to get into here. All right, so funnily enough, I actually went in here uh, as part of my side quest, so. Here's where we go our separate ways. Oh. Take this key. It unlocks the doors to the other tombs. Seek them out and lay claim to the power they hold. You'll need it. And what will you do? Keep an eye on the Nifs. Find out what they're up to. But you should focus on your own task. I will. You take care. Okay, so this is going to be quite sad then, because I've already been here. And I didn't realize that I was going to have to be here literally for the main game i thought that this was just gonna be a side quest mission so now you guys are not gonna see all of the um like prompto freaking out coming down into the dungeons oh that's ah and i've already killed the boss too oh that's really sad i mean if you guys want to see that definitely check out part one of my side quests i've got two different playthroughs going on 
at the moment, so... Hey, goblins! It's got, like, boss music here. It's weird. Wait, let's use this weapon. Sorry. I can't even see what I'm doing. Let's go. Yep. Yeah, that makes me really, really sad because I was going through the side quests. And now I feel like because I've been in this area, I'm so glad I didn't do any more actually. Oh poopies. Bah! I kinda wish Core would stick around a bit longer actually. But yeah, now I realize who that fifth member was in the wallpaper. Right, I have come the wrong way, I think. I do need to make some more magic at some point, so I can't go that way to go this way. But hey, at least I'm honest about it. <laughs> Well, it's kind of hard not to be honest about the fact that you've uh, already explored an entire section. But the good thing is, the other dungeons are really high level. You have to be like, mm, I think it was a good level 32 or something like that in order to really progress in those dungeons. So, where we can go, yeah, we can just keep going this way. I saw that little gobbly goo. This was where the boss fight was. I can't believe that I've done like a storyline boss already. Damn it, I wish I had known. And on we go. On we go. Right. Cause everyone's gonna be like, wait, where's the boss, Susie? So I can send my side quest one. Okay, because I came here and I was like, I got to the end of the the tunnel bit here. That's weird. The hell. All right, so now we actually have the key for the royal tomb. So let's see what's behind door number one. Why am I thinking there's gonna be a boss in here? Knocked borrows the old king's powers. <laughs> More or less. At this rate, he'll soon rival his father's legacy. The copycat king. Adeline. Well, what's it like? Hmm. Like I've got some tricks up my sleeve. No need to put on a magic show for us. Um, yeah, alright. I suppose if I can return to entrance without having to run around, that's pretty good. So that's really unfortunate. Um, as I say, yesterday I did a side quest thing and I came across that dungeon and just for fun I wanted to go inside and see exactly what I could do. I didn't realize that that was going to be a story part of it as well. Yeah. Finally picked up. But I'd lost another king. <sighs> just busy building my arsenal. Good to hear. I have a task for you. The Empire's begun construction of a new base, along the road west to the sky. I need you to put it out of commission. If left unchecked, it will cost us access to the west and all the royal tombs that lie beyond. I believe you've met Monica. She can fill you in on the details. Go see her. What's up? Uh, people to see, bases to burn. Let's go see Monica at the outpost. So, that's pretty cool. That means that we're gonna go all the way down here. I wonder if it's gonna be there, that the, the base is. Yeah, because that was the first demo area, was it not? Where the, the behemoth 
Lies? That's cool. Come to think of it, we did spy a large structure. Yeah, hard to miss an ominous thing like that. Ain't gonna be easy taking down a whole stronghold. Can we really do this? The Marshal believes we can, or he wouldn't have asked us. But first things first. Right. Let's head back to the outpost. Oh my god! Look how OP the enemies are here! That's level 30! Ignis, oh my god, you're dead. Jeez, Louise, why are the enemies so OP here? At least I know where to come and grind. Wow. That was adorable though. It's nice to see some of the older Final Fantasy enemies actually here. Because that one I remember from practically every single Final Fantasy. Right, so we're pretty close to where Monica is. This is awesome though, it's so nice to finally be out of the Judgment Disc demo and to see stuff that is brand Man, new to me. Who knew Kor was such a badass? I'm just glad he's on our side. Did I just see something floating there? What happened to all the guards? There was a lot of guards and stuff that were just there. I do need to learn how to put uh, spells into my uh, teammates as well, so that they can start casting spells alongside me. I will at some point go and fight those uh, enemies though. So, note to self, the top of the map We're is here. extremely OP. Hey lady! There she is. Your Highness, the Marshal has apprised me of the plan. We found a back door into the Imperial base. I'll mark the route on your map. The way is secure. You should be able to gain entry relatively easily. Okay, so let's have a look and see. I bet it's near the bottom of the map. Oh. Is that it? Or. Wait, where is it? Oh, it's right here. Oh, that's random. Declaration of War. Oh. Why did I think it was going to be absolutely miles away? Should we take the car? Kind of feel like I'm being lazy. No, let's take the car. My car is beautiful. That's so annoying though that during the day I have to go auto. So, let's go map point. And we'll just put the car here. Why can't I go? Yes, there we go. I love that. It's awesome. Yep. All right. What do you guys think of my car? It's beautiful, right? Music. So, who is this Monica person? A servant of the Crown's Guard, like Gladio and myself. She's one of my father's best, along with Dustin. Who's guarding my sister? Hmm. Good to know we still have people we can count on outside the city. Where do we go from here? Oh god. I killed a bunch of these guys yesterday and I actually felt really bad about it. How the heck do I get up there? How do I get up there? Is a really good question. Unless it's down... No, it's totally round. That's weird. I need to be... I think I need to be up there, but... There's no way I can get through here because it's going to be sealed off. Maybe we can have a look at the door. First and see. Oops. So they've blockaded the road, but... How? How, how, how? <laughs> Let's just follow the cliffs and see if there's a way to get round. There has to be a way to get round. This has to be. Boom! Sorry, Kath. See, it says... Oh my god, stop that. See, it says it's vulnerable to that attack, but actually it's... I don't know if it is. Maybe I can just... We're good. I don't do nearly enough battles in my actual playthrough. Like, I keep jumping with them. <laughs> I keep jumping with my, like, skills and stuff. 
it kind of feels like I'm the only one doing all the work here. So he's quite weak to my attacks, this guy. Let's try this. In fact, I want to try and see how he is with this magic attack. Oh! That near enough, like, knocked it out. Oh, damn it, I need to... Uh, damn it! I am gonna die at this rate if I'm not careful. I can't believe, like, I had my first game over yesterday live on stream and it was really depressing. Right, he's dead. We got one left, let's get it. Thank you, at least someone's backing me up. Woo! It's pretty weak to that attack, actually. So that weapon is nowhere near as good. Oh, wait a minute, I'm on fire from myself. What do you mean I forgot about you to tell you what to do? Are you guys not attacking? The game is up. <laughs> I'm still on fire. Um. Ah, got it. It's like a little secret path. How did you get here, lady? From here, we will split into two groups. Prince Noctis, please join the marshal up ahead. The rest of you will assist me in the diversionary effort. Why did he not say that? It's weird. I'll see you guys later. You go give him hell. We'll do the same on our end. Oh, I don't like the idea of being split from my men. I don't like this. Ugh. I don't like enclosed spaces. Gives me horrible anxiety. <laughs> So I am on my way to the first demo area. Now there was something I was thinking earlier. I don't know how many of you played the Platinum... Oh hey Kor. The Platinum Once demo. We're in, we launch our ambush, pushing out while support pushes in, crushing the enemy from both sides. And I wonder if I'll get to play that section in this game, you know? The Platinum demo where you play as Noctis as a kid. Would be pretty cool. All right, Core, it's just me and you, baby. Are you coming? Is it just gonna be me? Uh oh, shoot! Should be relatively easy because I'm a pretty high level, so hopefully, anyway. I don't even need Core. I got this. Never mind. Focus on the battle. Yeah. What do you mean, whips? Are you doing anything? I feel like I'm doing all the work here. Oh, now they're getting stronger. Level six. Come on. Swing that sword, baby. I know a lot of people will give me a lot of grief for always using this sword, but it does so much damage. I can't believe Core's not doing anything. Don't get used to it. I'll be gone before you know it. You better not be. We're gonna have a boss and you know it. Let's warp to them. Boom! Shoot. Right, I've got potions. I'm gonna have to warp away. Oh my gosh. Die! <laughs> Core, please help me! He is totally not helping me. Stop it! Damn it. Where can I warp? There we go. Hey guys! Boop! This weapon is. Oh, it's so good. Did I get them? Yeah, got them. Come on, Cora, let's do this. It's so weird not having my usual teammates. It makes me feel a bit anxious. 
compromise your focus. Yeah, yeah. Oh, God! I almost feel like I should be taking out the little ones first. Damn it. Oh my god, these guys are crazy! Look how much health! Oh my gosh, I only just realized how much health that- Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no! Bloody snipers. No! Come on, Kor, help me! I'm gonna need to change up my strategy in a minute. The thing I really like about this sword as well is it tends to stun them. Like, if I can level up this sword, I'll be so happy. So it should be. Otherwise, you'd only get in everyone's way. Could have gone it alone if I wanted. That mentality could prove your undoing, Highness. Wait a minute, it's saying to go down there, but I need to go this way, I think. I really need somewhere to warp to so I can get my MP back. Ugh. Yeah, I just realized how much HP Core has. I hope that's not an advisory. <laughs> oh, nice, I'm on the other side, sweet. Knocked! Marshal, it's good to see you again. All right on your end? Right as rain. The Nifs couldn't take their eyes off us. Thanks to you, we were spared their attention. Stay right where you are! Well, well, if it isn't Kor the Immortal. So, you survived the Citadel. But you won't survive what I have in store for you. It's past time your legend came to an end. Okay, we can do this. I feel like we should be taking out the snipers first. God, there's so many of them! Oh, Holy shit! And uh, that is not good. Pronto! I need some magic ASAP. I desperately need... Oh my gosh, what do I have? I got tons of... In fact, ice tends to be really good, so let's just go for... Uh, right, hold on a second. Dual cast, chain level. I'm thinking this one. All right, let's equip that. All right, you guys ready? Let's do it. First bows. Ow. Someone needs to cure. Ah, oh, darn it. Someone already got to him before me. Right, I'm gonna go for the snipers. I can't believe we're having to do this at night time. Come on! Freaking snipers are so annoying. Right, screw this. I gotta be a lot faster at this point. Right, I got no... Oh my god! This is hard. I do not have enough potions for this. Yeah, get lost. I'm trying to keep my distance, but I'm trying to kill these freaking snipers! Let's fall out of the battle zone. Watch this. Too slow. Crap, crap, crap. Right, I need to point warp. Did I just miss it? No. 
There we go. Right, it's down. Run, 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 run. Okay, I think we've taken out. No, we haven't. There's still another guard there. I'm nervous. I'm really nervous right now. Uh, Caesar, what are you doing? I need to take out that other. Oh my god. Watch out! I'm trying so hard to stay out of its searchlight. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Come on, we can do this! Please don't kill me. Come on, Gladio. I'm so quiet right now, I'm just like... We can do this, I know we can do this. Whoa, good! No, we're not leaving you! You will be defeated. Come on, we can do this! Whoa! I don't even know what happened there. Ignis! No, no, no! Come on, Sizzy! I need to stay away from him. If he does not move on me too many more times. Shit, Ignis. I got seven high potions, I think I'm gonna be fine. I'm pretty confident right now. Yes! Come on! Keep hitting him! Come on! Never mind. Focus on the battle. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. It's so over right now. Glory! Do the Empire! Hell yeah! Woo! Oh man! Impressive. Seeing you in action puts my mind at ease. It's clear I don't need to worry anymore. I'll return to watching the NIFs. Till next time, take care. Yay! There was a few times I was a bit worried. Not gonna lie, I was a little bit worried just then. Ain't so bad out here once you get used to it. Still a lot we haven't seen, though. And a lot for us to do. <sighs> yeah. Buck up. We're just getting started. <sighs> I feel really bad for Noctis, actually. Definitely seems like he's been thrown into this life and he's not too, too sure about it. So that's the end of chapter two already. It's crazy. So let's take a look at some of our snap moments. That's interesting. Any... Oh, I always hate killing those guys. That's a cool one. Let's save that one. That one's actually not too bad either. You're doing good, Prompto. You're doing good. 
So we are starting chapter three. Kind of sad my guidebook didn't come today because I was wanting to plan a little bit more. But here we go, the open world. The Empire is a powerful foe and Noctis has far to travel before he can hope to reclaim the crystal. He sets out across new lands in search of the power of his forebears. Okay, so basically what we're doing then is we need to go to all these different tombs to get the power, I guess, is what we're doing. But I definitely want to look into more of the lore because um, at the moment, as I say, I'm going into this game completely blind. I haven't seen the movie, I haven't watched the animes, and pretty much just been avoiding anything that's major storyline based. Just so I can enjoy this in my own time and take it slow. So, the prince eludes death. And what of the elusive ring? Eluna Freya has absconded with it. Find and kill her. The ring is the final piece. We may do well to take her alive. The Six wields power beyond our imagination. The Oracle holds the key for the King. She could unlock many secrets. Nay, High Commander. Lord Ravis. The Imperial Army is now at your disposal. A moot point, while the fugitives remain at large. My men and I will continue our search for the Prince and the Oracle. So glorious. My crystal. world here we come we can finally leave this dust bowl behind let's see if this works beyond the vast by comparison to lead bigger's better more stuff to see and do first comes to sky a region known for its wetlands really wetlands there's also a chocobo forest now we're talking further west lies the clane region wherein we'll find the town of lestal isn't that where Iris is headed? Barring delay, she should have arrived by now. Maybe even had herself a look at the meteor. And the meteor of the Six? The same. Its heat is harnessed to power the Stalin. Whoa, that sounds way cool. I'm actually looking forward to this. So wait, we're in a... a long drive. Best fill up the tank before we set out. Yeah, we're in a completely new area now. So where's Cindy? <laughs> where's our latest Cindy? We have a solid lay of the land now. The driver's seat is yours, Noct. If you so desire it. So Noctis can now drive the car wherever he wants. Oh, nice! That is awesome! Who could this be? Hello? Iris? It's really you. So good to hear your voice. Everything's fine over here. We managed to make it to Lestalem. We just settled into our new digs. So yeah, let me know when you're coming so we can meet up. Yeah, we will do. You better. Okay, so I'm not too sure who this person is. <laughs> Can't even call her own brother. In all ah. fairness, yours wasn't the obituary broadcast all over Lucis. What about me? She say anything about me? Did you see that sign? Chocobos! Chocobos! No, no time for that. Need to get to Lestalem. Oh! It's still ages away. Come on, just a quick visit. Yes, we're going to the Chocobos. Sure. Let's check it out. Yes! Gonna be awesome. Oh my goodness. But unfortunately, guys, that is all I got time for in this episode of Final Fantasy XV. In the next one, we are going to see our first Chocobo. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.